Hi, this is Sasha Segan from PCMag.com with the new LG V10, LG's new premium Superphone phablet. Uh, let's take a look. The LG V10 is slim and well built. We have a stainless steel frame and a back that is a composite of silicone and polyurethane. Uh, they say it really resists scratches. Um, you see that you have the volume buttons and the power button on the back like on all recent uh, LG flagship phones. We have a 16 megapixel camera on the back and we have a 5 megapixel dual selfie cameras on the front. I'll get to that in a minute. Now also notice there's an AT&T logo here. Uh, this is anticipated to come out on all the major carriers in the US. Now look at the top of the screen here. Uh, LG calls this the second screen. This is really one 5.7 inch uh, quad HD display, but this little bit of the screen stays on all the time. Uh, it gives you uh, notifications, it gives you time, a little bit of weather. Uh, LG says you only lose 5% of your battery per day uh, by leaving the screen on all the time. Now when you turn the phone on, uh, the screen ends up doing different things, like now it's app shortcuts. If I go into the camera, it's camera controls. It's a lot like the way the Edge worked on the original Galaxy Note Edge, where this extra little bit of the screen is an extra little bit of quick functionality. Now speaking of camera, I'm going to turn the camera around and, uh, oh hey there Weston, and let's see if we can go into a frame. Now these dual selfie cameras, notice one of them is wider angle than the other. They're not higher resolution, they don't do 3D, but there's a wide angle and a narrow angle camera. Uh, very interesting, you can also do pic picture in picture. It's uh, definitely a different way to do, du to do dual cameras that we've seen. Uh, now, of course, we are running, uh, we're running Android 5.1 here uh, at the moment. Uh, there will obviously be an Android 6.0 upgrade at some point. We have a Snapdragon 808 processor, 4 gigs of RAM, um, and uh, there will be 64 gigs of storage, but also, hey there, SD card fans, if I can get the back off. Oh yeah, there's a micro SD card slot and a removable battery. Uh, a lot of people are going to like that. Uh, it's something that we're seeing less and less in phones nowadays. Now, the LG V10 is going to be premium priced. LG said it'll be priced uh, kind of like the iPhone 6S Plus, so maybe $849 for the 64 gig unit. Um, and it'll be out soon on all the major carriers, uh, probably in November. Um, let's do a little size comparison here. Here we have the LG V10 and uh, an iPhone 6S Plus. Notice they're about the same size, but one of them has a 5.5 inch 1080p screen, the other one has a 5.7 inch Quad HD screen. Um, so the LG V10 is uh, coming out soon. Of course, we will have a, a full review of it on PCMag.com. This is Sasha Segan from PCMag.com with the LG V10.